Guys, welcome to Cinema Sessions. Thank you. Do you have any idea what we're doing here? No, not a clue. <laughs> I mean, we're watching something and mm. commenting on it, so. Something was burning when we walked in. The whole place smells like popcorn. So I'm guessing we're watching a movie. Ah, action. Oh, you can get it quick with it. This is it's just happened. Yeah, how long ago did oh, you was... walk off court? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I mean, I walked off court like maybe like, I don't know, like 45 minutes ago, an hour ago. Mm. Yeah, you guys are quick with it. How was the tennis today? It was, it was pretty solid. I played I played well. I think that the matchup was good for me in general. What did you text me right after the match? I can't say that while we're... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. Mm. You kept looking the over. 5-0, the 5 0 game was hilarious, honestly. If, like, I, Why? I'd love to watch the 5 Taylor game. Taylor has a theory that if someone wins a set, 6-0, they always lose the, the next. Yeah, everyone knows the theory. That what? That they'll, you'll lose the next you'll set? You'll always lose the next if it's set. Like against someone, if it's against someone that you like should not be 6-0-ing, like, you'll probably Fair. lose yeah. the next Fair. set. So when he was up 5-0, I was like, is he going to try to lose this on purpose? And, and then you did. I, well, I kind of tried to lose it on purpose, and then like, the half like tank shots I was hitting like were going Just were going in. <laughs> and then like, and then, and then some like, have. I know, I kept and then there were some like really big tank shots that I made sure didn't go in, and then the game went back and forth a little bit, and then I just looked at them and was like, okay, whatever, I'll just... <laughs> I'll try to win the game. For you guys coming down to Australia, what's the, obviously there's a job to do, but it's a pretty great way to start the new year, right? Yeah, I mean, Love it's, it. yeah, it, it's a great place. Like Morgan especially likes being in Australia and it's, Australia. yeah, it's, it's, it's a great place to start the year. Cause it's summer, everyone's off work, everyone's just having fun. It's, cr I mean, the grounds outside right now are packed cause everyone, yeah. all the people who went to work today then come afterwards and drink and it's a whole, it's a party. A whole thing. It's a whole is. party. It's work. Mm. I mean, everyone's, and it's fun. Yeah, everyone's so excited like about the tennis here. It's it's great. It, like this Melbourne, like this time of the year is so fun. And then all the players also coming off of like an off season. Everyone's really excited to be like playing yeah. and traveling again as opposed to like when we're like end of the year grinding. We've done so yeah. many weeks in a row and everyone's like, oh my God, like it's very back to school vibes, right? Mm -hmm. For like sure. it, in in a good way. For it's sure. like, oh I got a new backpack. Back to <laughs> yeah. school. Okay. This is 12 months ago. Yeah. It's kind of a cool shot. Breakpoint launch. What's it been like for, I'll start with you, Morgan, being a part of this series? Uh, it was super fun. I think it was a very much fly on the wall sort of situation. It didn't feel like they were super encroaching or asking us to talk about certain things. Um, and I'm just so glad that we got, <laughs> I'm like, come over here. I'm really glad that we got the whole Indian Wells thing documented mm -hmm. like that's against it all such yeah. a cool moment for you and i'm glad that we'll be able to have that forever yeah, I'm, I'm really lucky that that we got that for the the show and so it's <gasps> all... best day of my life oh, oh yeah this is Ooh, what we tell see the me. all right so we're in perth we're in wa and you're going to rottnest island mm. yes to mm. see the quokkas the smiliest animal on the planet oh my god it's the cutest thing i've ever seen in my life <laughs> This has been on my bucket list for years. Actually, I posted an Instagram story the first time we came to Australia four years ago, and I was like, I'm heartbroken. We're not going to be able to see the quokkas. <laughs> this was such a cool experience. I was begging Taylor before we went, like, we have to make sure we see the quokkas yeah. when we go to Perth. Mm. Is, is that really... why you played United Cup, so that you guys could see the quokkas? <laughs> yeah. Well, the thing is, normally I don't like to, like, I don't know, go out and do these, like, big excursion-type things, but, like, this was one thing that I, like, actually really wanted to do, so it was great that we got to be, like, organize it through the tournament to, to go do this because like it is like a whole day thing but they they flew us in the helicopter they made it quick mm -hmm. like it was like i mean this so is one cool. of those things that i was really excited to do also okay so and really there was a lot of hard work going in for these selfies <laughs> yeah. yeah they're not easy to get i think that's the thing a lot of people don't know and i guess we didn't know is that sometimes people go out there for hours trying to get the perfect quokka selfie they were very were pretty cute. good yeah it was, it looks it was like, really fun i'm just curious from your perspective of being on tour, you mm. know, you were just talking about like you knew what was going through his head at 5-0 today. Mm -hmm. What is it like for you to sit there and to feel all this pressure and not be able to really do anything about it? You know, we have been together for so long now. I can tell when Taylor's nervous or extra stressed about a match and however he feels is how I feel when he goes out and has a match like today where he's so confident he's just ripping forehands I'm I'm chill I'm good most of the time during matches I'm I'm stressed I'm nervous about what's going yeah. on I'm on edge for a point what vibes do you want from the box like true loud, true when, loud, true loud, yeah true I loud. mean when I'm when I'm like winning a big point or like mm. something like that like mm. I want to like you know fist bump and look at them and then see them celebrating too for sure like I, don't, I, I definitely don't want to hear them like talking to me when I'm like losing or playing bad. Like I don't want to hear like, come on, like 
try harder. <laughs> it's like, Do I don't not? want. Not really. Like, I don't really need the encouragement when I'm losing. Or, I, I like, I just wanted, like, I like when that's I. What you need it most. Mm, I just, but I feel like I don't, I don't really, like, even, like, acknowledge it or hear it then. I notice it, like, when I look to you guys when I'm, like, celebrating a point or, like, I win a point or I'm about to play a big point. Mm. Then I like that, like, you know, like, come on, let's go. What's been the most, I mean, you've now done the circuit for two or three years. What mm -hmm. has been the one thing that you've, like, loved the most or maybe surprised you the most about? being so close to pro tennis. What surprised me the most is how into it I've gotten. When I first started traveling with Taylor, and I've been super open about this, I didn't know anything. I didn't even know what ATP really stood for because where I grew up, ice hockey was the big sport. Mm. So coming into it, I I didn't I didn't know anything. You had to teach me from mm -hmm. ground or point one. Is gosh. there any way we could rewind that back for like 10 seconds? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want you guys to just tell me what, if you can read my lips to what I said at ah, night. I was. really want to see it. Good match, man. Some Something with an F-bomb. Yeah. <laughs> right? I said you're really effing good, man. <laughs> <laughs> he played really, I mean, you said that impressed too. Yeah. yeah. No, he, he, really did, but he played really well. Actually, one of the hardest matches I've ever sat through was three, it was either three or four years Batista. ago, Batista, go, yeah. five mm. sets mm. in the sun on one of the hottest days of Australian it was Open. So hot that day. It was so hot. Like, I'm I'm about to pass out. I'm taking breaks between sets to go. I'm a, a baby about the heat because I'm from the Midwest and same, I'm just same and same. It. Yes. I don't know how you do it sometimes. That was a hard match to go through. The weather's been more forgiving this year, which has been nice. Uh, lastly, I want to ask you guys. You're both very driven people. How do you feel like you're driving each other right now in, in life? And I know I know Taylor has big goals. I'm guessing in your career you do too. Mm -hmm. But how do you feed off of one another to hopefully get to where you want to go? Uh, I'd say, I mean, Morgan's just like really on me about like, I guess like just discipline, like doing the right things. It's, it's helped a lot, like bring a lot of just like mm. balance and like good hab like healthy habits to my life. Some stuff as simple as just like eating healthier and like going to sleep earlier and, and, and then also just obviously having someone just supporting you and, and helping you along the way. It's, it's, it's definitely made a big difference and improved like just like my day to day, how I feel when I'm training, practicing, I'm not waking up like tired, I'm, I'm fitter and it, it's, yeah, I mean, it's made a big difference. Nice. I think it's fun. It's mm. fun to be like young and traveling together and both working towards everything mm. we could dream of. And we've both kind of had this collective goal of like bringing tennis to a younger audience. And he kind of does his part of that. And I, well, there's me doing the content, <laughs> trying to do to do mine. And I think you kind of like the content stuff. You're a little shy in front of the camera, but he's really yeah, but... supportive, I think. It's been so nice that you know, we've found this thing that I can do and this thing that he can do, mm -hmm. and our lives just work mm -hmm. very well together now. Yeah. Yep. Awesome. Guys, thanks for hanging out with us on the Cinema Sessions mm -hmm. couch. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank yeah, you for no having worries. us. Yeah, of course.